we also demand that our colleagues should be released unconditionally because their continued detention is an illegality. They are in illegal detention. They have gone beyond the 48 hour rule. Uh, rather, they have violated the 40 hour rule. They have gone be beyond the 40 hour, 48 hours they are allowed to have somebody in custody. Since 24th, today is the 28th, the Constitution dictates that produce, no, first and foremost, you tell one, you tell them, upon arrest, immediately upon arrest, that's what the Bill of Rights say in Article 28 of the Constitution. It commands that within, immediately upon arrest, inform the people you have arrested or whose liberties you have curtailed of the charges they have against them, you are preferring against them. That never happened. Even as they keep, they keep them right now in, the, in their cells there at Nagarama, they have not been told the offenses they, have, they are preferring against them. We hear it in corridors. They are murmuring, which case do we have against? Do we handle it legally? Do we handle it politically? You can imagine. Either tomorrow or the following day, we intend to raise this matter with the Kenyan authorities. We want to issue a protesting note. We are going to, definitely, we are going to issue a protesting note to Nairobi, through their embassy here, on this matter. Because they had a duty after the meeting, our colleagues in their, within their territory, they had a duty of giving them all the protection they needed, they required. The authorities in Kenya know exactly what, is, what happened to the people they allowed to be carried away, taken away, driven away. Do they know? <laughs>